The Salvation Army to me is a home. The Salvation Army is a community, it's a family, and provides hope and joy. And that's what it means to me. When I was looking for a home church, a place to do ministry, I wanted it to look like Jesus. And the things I came to were caring for the poor, caring about holiness, and that's what the Salvation Army is all about. That's what excites me about um, ministry in the Salvation Army is that it is there's no limit to it. It's in every possible opportunity and privilege we have connecting with others. The Salvation Army means expressing the love that God has shown to me through Jesus. Salvation Army means for me hope, because I wasn't born here in Canada, right? So as a child, I was sponsored, grown up Salvation Army, and I know the benefits of that. And I guess that's why I say hope, but it's hope is not sufficient enough to explain. To me, Salvation Army means relationship. It means building trust. It means being a safe place for everybody in our communities. It means walking alongside, sharing the love of Jesus and being that transforming influence. It's my hope and desire that those who walk through our doors will know the love of Jesus Christ by what we can share with them. I can do all things through Christ who gives me strength. Just trusting in all areas of my life that he is leading me and guiding me. Really learning about who I am as a confident woman of God. The Salvation Army means to me that it's my church it's where I found Jesus. To me, the Salvation Army is people that are mobilized to save souls, grow saints, and serve suffering humanity. We were actually uh, given these little mirrors, a reminder about what it means to reflect the light of God to others. But if I truly want to be a reflector of holiness and my desire is to seek holiness of my entire being, I need to be open to showing all of me to the world, to using all of my life to reflect God's holiness and not just a public ministry or a public persona, but to use every aspect so that more of God is seen. I grew up as an officer's kid. It is where I have always been able to come back and feel a sense of belonging and feel a sense of comfort. I have a place here, it really is home for me. I hear God's voice, he speaks to me and he speaks to me so clearly and, uh, and I know which way to go. Think of what you were when you were called. Not many of you were wise by human standards, not many were influential, not many were of noble birth. I just, I'm inspired to think that God can use even me to do great things. I'm excited about my mom becoming an officer because it gives her a new experience. I'm happy for her on a whole because, you know, it's a, it's a fun thing to do and, you know, it opens up a lot of new, exciting adventures. I think my mom is going to be an evangelist in the church and my dad's going to be, like, a, have a core and he's going to be like a pastor. Being a Christian means loving Jesus. To me, it means, you know, walking a life that is good, being a good person. Being a Christian means to me that you are kind, you help those in need, and you are praising God every day with everything that you do. I love Jesus because He loves everyone equally in the whole entire world. What being a Christian means to me is that I love my enemies and I'm not mean, even if people are mean to me. I love Jesus because He, he, he treats everyone the same. He treats us equal, equally. Being a Christian means being protected by God and also dedicating yourself to God. I would say Jesus is like water. You can't live without it, you know? 